So guys, Breezy Gaming TV here. In this video, I'm gonna talk about how to hold long A and cat. So it's gonna be split into two parts. Uh, I'll, I'll try to put some time stats below if I can. I normally kind of like doing these kind of timestamps things when I'm doing these longer videos just to explain what, how to do this and that. So look out for the description below for some timestamp and stuff like that. So let's start with long A. There's two ways to doing long A. One if you have a really good spawn and one if you don't have a good spawn. Let's go. So let's say if you have a good spawn like this. Hold knife out. Just hold W all the way. Now hold A here. And as soon as I... I go through this garage thing, I'm going to get a molly out. And as soon as I cross the blue bin, I'm going to hold A and W at the same time. I'm going to throw my molly. And it goes into the door. Don't worry if it just goes outside here or if it hits the wall here. It's okay. What you want is to them to not come out. So And then you get to pit here. So once you get to pit, there's a lot of things you can do. But let's just do it one more time full speed so you guys can see what's up, right? So like here. Now I'm in pit, right? So you can see this is all in one motion. So you, you don't stop. I just stopped earlier just to show you guys how I do it, right? So that that's to molly inside door. But if you see that they don't respect your molly and they're rushing out, what you can do instead of holding your your uh, crosshair so high, just do it lower, right? So they're going to get burned out when they're crossing down, okay? Two ways of doing it but they both work for me i never had any trouble with it now once you're here what do you do you don't just stay pit right you're not you're not just gonna stay pit right here and wait for them to to jump on you and like and then you're like oh shit four's on me right now oh no you don't do that so there's two ways of doing it what i would do is watch your molly and watch a little bit and get info so let's say oh a terrorist came out oh shit what do i do well you can do a flash on this side not straight but more on this side. So you do a jump throw with a flash on this side and you peek with the flash. You see, it flashes behind here, right here, right? So you can peek with the flash and then now you can take your fights, right? Another thing you can do is if ever like you want to stall time, you can take a, a smoke. There's no lineup for this. You just chuck it, run throw, and it'll land here or even in the door. It, like I said, it really doesn't really matter because what you want to do is make sure that that they can't come inside, right? Or come outside of, of the, 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 the long doors. So now you can peek here and can wait. Now, uh, you use a molly, you use the smoke, you have a flash. You use a flash, or you might have a flash or a nade left, depending on what you got. So my recommendation is buy two flashes. And you have another flash here. So imagine like they're taking they're taking uh, A from cat, then you have one flash to support your, t your, your teammates. Or there's sometimes a lurk on long A, so you can actually like wait and maybe like, oh, they're coming out and do a second flash. And then you can fight, right? That's one way to take long A if you have a good spawn. If you don't have a good spawn, never attempt this. I I'm telling you, never attempt this because uh, if they have a really good spawn and you have a bad spawn, you're going to get opt or, or you're going to get flash. You won't make it. So by the way, if you're going to pit with that kind of strat, if even if you get flash, keep going you need pit control like if you have that spawn you shouldn't get killed you have to run to pit throw that molly knife out run in right so what do you do if you don't have a good spawn so when i don't have a good spawn i like going to the second tire of the car right here and getting a smoke out and line your cross here to here a little bit to the left of the building left click and that smokes door Right, so if there's an opera here, then well, the opera is useless now. So what I do after, I throw one flash here, just to buy myself some time, and also like right here, I don't know if they went to blue bin or not, right? So what I what I will do is I'm going to throw, uh, oops, I'm going to throw the small. You see this black uh, brick right here? Bounce it off here, and it's gonna bounce into blue bin. So blue, anyone blue bin is gonna get burned, right? If you hear burning, or if you don't hear burning, it doesn't really matter. Just make sure that. If the smoke is still there, you can do this flash, and you can peek very wide. But if you don't have the smoke there, you can still do this flash, but you can just peek door instead, right? Because if you hold do wide, uh, multiple people might be looking at you. So this is one other way of holding long A. But what if, what if you don't have a good spawn and you and you're running here, and you're flash right away? Oh, fall back! Don't fight it! 
don't, honestly don't fight it if you if you don't have a good spawn and you get flush don't fight it the only time that you want to cross the pit is only when you have the perfect spawn and i repeat the perfect spawn so right here what do you do right here do you peek no you don't because it's it's very common for terrorists to have an op playing right here they yeah they play right here they're gonna hold here and then stand up and hold you do this right uh, i do this i'm guilty of this right so don't ever, ever, ever peek elevator. What you could do is, most commonly, I've noticed in every pug, in every game, terrorists love doing one of these two smokes right here. One and two smoke, right? So when this happens, I throw a flash right away to buy some time. I spam to scare them. And then I throw a smoke of my own right here. Just a right click. And then I do a flash here. And I peek with a flash. Right? The whole reason why I do this is because... The op can see me, and if they really want to come towards long A, they either have to run through my smoke, or they have to run on the left, on their right side, my left side of the smoke. And you see the timing, it works out, because their smoke is gone before my smoke is gone. This is very important. That's why you don't smoke at the same time that they smoke. Because the whole reason of this is that you want to waste their smoke. If, if it's too even better, you waste two of their smokes, and you buy time for your teammates to rotate. So they're going to be in CT spawn already, like... Like right here, ready with you. They take the first fight, and then you you swing with them, right? You wait here, you wait here, you wait here, right? So this is another way to do it. This is very, 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 very good. Don't ever be boneheaded and try to do this by yourself and run through their smokes. You're gonna be you're gonna be seeing four or five terrorists, and you're gonna get killed, and your team's not gonna like it. Instead, do this lurk smoke while these two smokes are here. Do a flash, come out with a flash, and hold this angle and wait and wait. And wait and wait and then fall back okay that's all long a i have for you that's the way i play it now how how do i play cat so depending on how you want to play cat like if you really want to take deep position of cat you can uh try to oh oh no i messed up already where well, you can do this and take this road and then you can molly cat like this uh deeper mike deeper that's what she said deeper okay deeper and then you can hold here and listen. Some if, if teams are trying to go through cat really fast, you can hear them. You can smoke right in front of your own molly. And and never, 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 never cross here. Because if I'm terrorist, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be spamming here, right? I'm gonna be spamming here all the time. So just hold here. Just wait here. Wait let them waste their bullets. Alright? And what you can do after the smoke is gone, be on the floor level, aim anywhere around the stairs here or in the third fly the stairs uh run jump throw and you can see the flash bounce like lands here or anywhere around here and then you can peek with the flash but the thing is you have to wait okay so you do this wait a little bit and then 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 do it right uh my mistake is careful don't do it too much on this side you, you'd rather be really on the middle side of your of the wall here so run throw i messed it again it's a really finicky thing there you go or if you just want to do it an easier way, you can always flash here, uh, double double click, and then fight it. Right? Just it's just that it, they're gonna see the flash, right? So fight. Depend on how you want it. That's the that's one way of holding cat. Another way to do it is you can just peek like this with a molly, right? We call this a Kenny S bot because Kenny S ops here and he's really fast, gets a kill all the time. But you're not Kenny S. Just play with a molly. You see them coming, molly jump down. Right? And depending on what's happening here, you can boost the teammate to go up, or you can ask him to boost you up to get back up. Uh, or you can play Cat from this spot right here. I know this is long, I know. But if they're coming on A from Cat, you can still support your whole team by flashing here. Which flash here, so anywhere on site, they can peek. Right? Or even Goose Guy can peek, right? Goose Guy can help. So that's one way to playing Cat. Or also, if you want to react, if ever like they they do this, the lurk smoke right here, uh, which is like a oh, well, that or that it doesn't really matter. It's same, it does this, it does the same thing, right? If they do this smoke right here, what I would do is I would never peek around here because normally there's a one way here, and you can't see him, but they can see you very well. So never peek here. What you can do instead is molly in front of their smoke, 
to prevent anyone from pushing. So what you do right here is you buy time. Again, you buy time. You don't want to force fights right now. You just want to buy time until that smoke is gone. And your molly is going to disappear first, right? Like in real time situation, if I do this correctly, they're going to smoke this. Me, I'm like, oh shit, they did it one one may smoke. Molly. Then hold here. See, anyone walks through your molly. And then when this molly is about to, to fade away, I'm going to do this flash right here. And I'm going to fight this. I'm just buying time because I want this smoke to fade away so everyone can actually fight this easier and they wasted their utility. Smokes are very, very important for terrorists. If they waste it, it's really bad for them. So this is a way, good, really good way of doing it. Uh, alternatively, if you're playing cat um, from goose here, you can do a double click on the anywhere on the leaf of the, uh, of the tree here. And then you can fight with the flash. The reason why this is a good flash is because it kind of camouflages how you throw the flash. You can see, I don't really see the flash. So if I do dot throw just to see my last flash, I I, I didn't see it. I tried to look for it. I didn't really see it. I get flash. So like if ever uh, I get flash and then you peek with that, then you can kill him. It's very effective, like I said. So you do this. Wait here behind the wall. Peek, right? It's really strong. Um, now, if you're playing with a knob here uh, on A, the best spots to play with op is definitely here, but you need a teammate backing you up. You need a teammate that's already long or in pit, uh, could be long behind long doors or in pit because, uh, you know, you can't be looking at two places at once, right? A lot of teams, when they hit cat, they like hitting long at the same time. So make sure you have a teammate here. If you do, then you're in it for a field day because all you have to do is get one pick, hold a different angle, get a second pick and hold another angle, right? It's very easy to play with op if you have someone already in pit. Or around long doors uh, another good spot is to play around here with the op you can shoot here and then you can peek here again you know it's a very good spot here to play with the op all right just know where you want to play with the op the, the spot that really sucks with the op i'd say goose is not really good with the op because most of the time even when they're executing their opper is gonna wait for you he's just while the other team is doing whatever he's gonna wait on you and then when you peek you're dead right it's a bait like good T oppers will just wait for your mistake and this place is a one and done because if you get a kill, you're just here all the time. You can't really escape. If you're here, you can peek from this side, can peek from this side. Uh, you can actually also peek from this side. So you have way more places to peek from. Uh, the goose, you only have one way to peek and it's goose, <laughs> right? So yeah, this uh, this has been a video on how to hold uh, long A and cat uh, on dust too. I knew it's gonna be long, I know myself. So I hope that you guys like this video. Uh, cheers. Uh, stay tuned for the middle and also the B for this series. Okay. Take care, guys. See you.